Hi everyone from Hobbs Inc. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got a kind of beer from Fantastic Verdant from Farm of Cornwall. What's that t-shirt? Completely by accident. It, honestly it is. I've been wearing it all day. <laughs> and it's a kind of the too many opinions watered down the original idea. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> it's a West Coast double IPA. Yeah, yeah, you read that right. A West Coast IPA from Verdant. 9.2% ABV. I'll give you the, sh the spiel on the back. So... Uh, the malts are extra pale and caramel malts are very simple than the hops are Simcoe, Amarillo, Cascade, Columbus and Chinook. And the yeast is BRY. It's 97. I don't know what that is. don't know who that is. Um, it says uh, clean mobile um, and tones of piney resin, Simcoe, blah, blah, blah. Just listen to the hops. Yeah. Excited to try this. Let's get this open see what it's like. Well, uh, earthy, a bit of an earthy kind of note just then. So, beer in the glass. I'm going to go. It's on the, it's, it's, yeah, I'm going to haze for days kind of side. Look at that colour. I mean, it looks great on camera. Yeah, like radiant kind of burnt orange colour. Yeah, pure white foam, what there is of it. So let's give it a swirl and sniff. Check out the aroma. Ooh, funny. Mmm. First thing, oh, ma actually, uh, first thing I smelled was kind of, it smelled like, a bit like hot dog water. <laughs> kind of, yeah. But it's gone now. <laughs> that kind of like salty, briny thing going on. We do, we, she does probably have a little bit of that going on, but probably what I was missing, which I'm getting now, is loads of mango and orange. Yeah, very marmalade heavy. Grapefruit smells fucking good though. This is taking me back to drinking beers like Sintra from Knee Deep. Oh yeah, it's 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 big piney. Oh yeah, this is amazing. <laughs> this smells like being on holiday in California. For just big resinous, but juicy mango and orange. Marmalade stuff. Oh, oh it smells fucking good. It smells really orange <laughs> as the colour. Anyway, let's dive in. Cheers. Wow. I mean, that takes me back to. Yeah, yeah, that's Pliny. That's Pliny. But the one thing like, it really reminds me of, and this is when they were good. This is when Green Flash were good. It reminds me of Green Flash um, uh, Imperial IPA. Because it's got a nice... But that's so fucking good. That is... That's... We're going back six years to kind of like where kind of West Coast was perfection. I mean, I love West Coast. And this is a real reminder of how good it can be. Mm. And maybe I wish it didn't... It wasn't as big as it is. But I think you maybe get a little bit of the heft of the 9.2. It's crazy drinkable. Yeah. Big pine... Big, pithy orange. Loads of grapefruit. Loads of, yeah, pithy orange and uh, and marmalade. Mm. That's good shit. Oh man, that's good. Yeah, this is just like, I said, take me back to those beers like Simtra. Which is a bigger beer but drinks really light. And, and kind of the first time I drank like um, Ruin 10 and things like that. I've been really fascinated to some um, my friend like Ryan over in San Diego to try this and think, and because he's really anti uh, <laughs> New England style IPA, but he loves obviously he loves his West Coast IPA, and he knows it really well. I'd be really fascinated to see what he thinks of this. As as Matt over at Massive Beer Reviews really rates putty, he's a big juice head like me. I'd really be fascinated to see somebody like Ryan try that because I think it's incredible. Mm -mm -mm. Wow, yeah, that really takes me back. I think that is an absolute cracker. I'm gonna pour the rest of it. So that, <coughs> excuse me, that is a can of verdant. Too many opinions. Water down the original idea. A 9.2% ABV, West Coast 
double IPA, and it is an absolute screamer. Wow, what a beer. I'm rough and hops in, I'm getting old. I'm getting lost where I am. I just want to drink part oh, of this beer. Mmm. Cheers.